Hello my friends, welcome to Bunny Tales. Today we're going to learn how to make a fun math activity for your little ones. To start out with, we're going to need two pieces of cardboard. After you get two pieces of cardboard that are exactly the same size, you're going to measure it into as many long strips as you want to. I'm measuring out six here because my cardboard isn't very long, but if you have a long piece of cardboard, you can do all the way up to ten. After you measure out six long strips, you can measure out a rectangle at the bottom of each strip. After you're done measuring out all your rectangles, we can move on to the next step. Now I'm going to get some toilet paper rolls. I'm going to cut them down the middle, so I'm going to measure it out and then mark the middle. After I mark the middle, I'm going to Cut all the paper rolls down the middle. Next I'm going to mark out little circles in each strip. I'm going to start out with one, then two, three, four, and then go on as far as I go. After that, I'm going to cut out the rectangles and the circles, then glue the top piece of cardboard onto the bottom piece of cardboard. Once the top piece of cardboard is secured to the bottom piece of cardboard, I'm going to start gluing on the toilet paper rolls to the top. I'm going to glue one toilet paper roll on top of each strip. After I'm done with that, I'm going to start making the numbers. I'm going to take the little pieces of cardboard that we cut off before, the rectangles, and I'm going to draw a number on each one. I'm going to start out with one, I'm going to color it in, and then I'm going to make a dotted line with a white marker, and that is where the little one is going to trace the number. Now I'm going to use some clear tape to cover up the rectangle with a number on it. That way your little one can use a dry erase marker to trace the number and you can erase it and use it over and over again. Then you can repeat the process with the rest of the rectangles. Write the numbers, color them in and cover them with clear tape. After you're all done you're going to collect some resources. I've got some colored pom-poms here. I'm going to put them aside. I'm going to put my numbers aside and then I'm going to grab some colored craft sticks. After I have all the things I need, our little ones are ready to start using this activity. They're going to start out by counting the little circle, filling it in with a pom-pom. Then we're going to work on number correlation by putting one stick into the toilet paper roll, finding the card with the number one on it, and putting it in the rectangle, and then tracing it. Uh, we can repeat this activity with all the numbers. The more your child practices, the better they're going to become with their numbers. It's very important to use different methods of practicing numbers because children do get bored of repeating the same activity and that is why you're going to find many number activities on Bunny Tales. Please take a look at the other activities on Bunny Tales and subscribe to the channel. I hope you enjoyed making this learning resource and I hope your little one enjoyed using it to practice their numbers. Please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit the like button. Thank you!